And you can call your county ahead of time and see, you know, how, how do you um, determine the number of guests in each property? Um, this one right here that is in the picture, they determine it by square footage of the whole house. Um, the other one that we have, one is square footage of everything except the kitchen and bathroom. And one is cubic square feet in the sleeping rooms. <laughs> So it gets a little fun when you start. It, I, you there. just <laughs> like, you just have to figure it out. But that's to show you, you know, you each area is very different. Um, they also regulate what we have to provide and how we have to provide it. Um, so we have to. We don't. We do supply linens at all of our rentals, um, meaning bedding, and but we don't supply towels for the bathroom. Um, but we do, we are required to supply kitchen towels. Um, the reason I stopped supplying bathroom towels is because no matter how many you give them, they <laughs> use every single last one. And I'm like, this is adding a ton of laundry for my cleaning person. And y'all can bring your own flipping towels. If you're going to use 24 of them for three people in two nights. It, it was, then we had one really bad one where it's like they pulled every freaking towel out of the place and it was, you're like, what the world? But so, yeah. um, it just is in our check-in stuff that says, you know, make sure that you bring your own towels. Um, with that, I do have to also provide us all this working smoke detectors, carbon monoxide detectors. I have to have a, um, a fire extinguisher, fire extinguisher. Um, paper other towel. things we have to provide paper towel in the bathroom, uh, since we don't provide, um, towels for their hands. And of course, toilet paper. Right. We have not seen, we have not seen a big mess of paper towel yet. And we're waiting for that to happen. Someone forgot their towel and they'll just wipe down with a paper towel. No, we don't have that. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> That'll be the next thing. <laughs> so, and they also tell you how you have to have the house presented. Um, like for one instance, we don't, I don't know if you all know this and some of you, it might gross you out, but when you go to a hotel, they don't wash your comforter every single time. And so you don't have to wash the comforters every single time, only when they're soiled. And so the way they get around that is um, when you take the sheet, you have to fold the sheet 12 inches over top of the comforter, 12 inches so that when somebody curls up in there, their face isn't like on the comforter um, so that somebody else's face doesn't go like right where their face was. You'll notice now when you go to the hotels, there's always a fold over top of the comforter. Those things are regulated by the county um, and the like health department. 